Welcome to our tour of the seven chapters of the Revelation. On this, our last stop on the Amazing Race, we end our journey in Laodicea. Laodicea is situated on the long spur of a hill between the narrow valleys of the small rivers Asopas and Kapos. It was approximately 17 kilometers west of Colossae, 160 kilometers east of Ephesus. The city also benefited from its advantageous position on the trade route, became one of the most important and flourishing commercial sites of Asia Minor, in which large money transactions and extensive trade in black wool were carried on. Laodicea was a wealthy city. When it was destroyed by an earthquake, the citizens paid for the rebuilding of the city themselves, turning down relief funds. These wealthy citizens embellished the city with beautiful statues. It was one of the most visually stunning cities in Asia Minor. Known for its lack of fresh water supply, Laodicea received water from the hot springs of Hierapolis several miles away via an aqueduct. Water arriving by this means was normally lukewarm. If you visited modern Laodicea, you would see existing remains still attesting to its former greatness. The whole area of the ancient city is covered with ruined buildings. The ruins bear the stamp of Roman extravagance and luxury, rather than the stern and massive solidity of the Greeks. Its stadium, gymnasium and theatres are well preserved and amazingly enough, the seats in the theatre are still aligned perfectly. Truly it's a town of the lifestyles of the rich and the famous. We hope you enjoy your stay in Laodicea.